Sprache. Why motion software employees can work remotely? Working remotely in our company, it's not an option. That's the default model. Back in the days in 2015, while I was working as an enterprise consultant, I had really bad experience being stuck in the office for eight to 10 hours and not being able to enjoy the passions of my life. Thus, I decided to start a company where people can enjoy a better lifestyle and work at a time when they feel good and be at the place where they feel good. It's really important for us to give the freedom to our people to almost work as uh, freelancers, but at the same time have the security of a full-time employee. And since it started, our main value has been to be able to work from wherever you feel good at. I think this really helps with motivation, productivity, and for us, it is really important for people to feel comfortable. So um, our model is a remote first model. We offer a hybrid option if people would like to have one. So if people want to go to the office, we have the option. We actually did this um, a few times in other cities as well, where we get people connected from different cities and we give them an option to go to a co-working space or something like this so they can meet in person and really benefit from that uh, connection relationship. Yeah, um, I believe that offering the fully remote model is very important because people can really not only work from home, but go and live in other cities, in other countries and enjoy life uh, in its fullness. What are the benefits of being a flat company? Benefit number one is that people are really motivated and empowered to bring the change in the company, to be the change in the company and to innovate. We make sure that we're really transparent when it comes to the company's organizational structure and uh, all the decisions that we make um, business-wise. We really want people to engage um, into the future of the company and uh, this allows them then to really develop some entrepreneurial um, skills. One of the core values of our company is self-improvement and if self-improvement for you means that you want to become an entrepreneur uh, or join a new startup, we'll embrace that and we'll help you achieve that because by that way, you become a better person. It's really important that Christo has been quite a good mentor for people that want to start their own business uh, after they've been at Motion Software. Um, he's already done that, I think, a few times. We, in fact, we had one, one of our colleagues uh, who recently left to become uh, to make his own company. He was a chef before he joined uh, Motion. He actually, after being a chef, uh, made a course at Softuni and then joined the boot, our bootcamp program. Uh, then he became a software engineer with us and then continued on to do his own ventures and start his own business. And now we're actually his clients. So we're trying to support people and really help them with their entrepreneurial adventures. <laughs> How do we manage to keep people motivated in the remote environment? Actually, being remote is one of the factors that's motivating people because they can have better balance between their work and their lifestyle. So you can easily combine sports that you do or other activities that you do in your free time with your work. And actually, there are many studies showing that when you efficiently combine different kinds of activities, you're more productive at work. And this is also the result that we see with Emotion Software. And we also have a budget for that. So it's uh, basically trying to get people to have a better work-life balance. And really, I think this freedom gives them the kind of drive to go forward at, on the, at the workplace too. Other ways to motivate people is to be really 
personal again with them on each and every review that we do with them. Each quarter we do one-to-one -one review and they have this personal development plan that they're establishing with their personal lead and they are setting themselves some goals so that they can really have something to work towards, whether that's professionally or personally. How team buildings and team retreats help our company? We actually just introduced a new type of team gathering. It's called an outpost and we're going to different places in Bulgaria to work for a week or two to really build those bonds and relationships. I don't think anything beats in-person gatherings. So I guess now the corona is over, hopefully. Uh, we can really focus on getting people together I've actually also tried to match people in different locations and organize maybe some lunches or evening meals, some co-working days. It really helps people build those connections that you would normally build in an office. So um, team buildings are very important. Well, typically our team buildings are hike in the mountain or we go surfing on the beach or we do some fun activities with uh, action sports like kayaking, airsoft, mountain biking and so on. And we also try to design activities that are suitable for all kinds of people. So we have activities for people that want action sports, we have activities for people who want to spend more time with their family and uh, with their little children, for example. <laughs> What are the benefits of our platform? Motion Software started as a small consulting company, but it's turning into a product that enables businesses to match with top talent from Eastern Europe. So we designed features that enable that matchmaking process to happen in very seamless and easy way. One of the core benefits for our clients is that they can find the right people to work with in the matter of days rather than weeks and months, which typically takes with the traditional recruitment process. For the employees in particular, we're, we were really trying to help candidates really speed that process of job application and also some people feel uncomfortable in interviews when in person so we were really trying to tackle that issue too. What the workplace of the future will look like? Some of the most recent trends are that uh, people are looking to work in the so-called co-working spaces and also many people are looking to live in a co-living spaces. In future, I see a trend where people will have co-working slash co-living communities and these will be places where they live full time. And I also believe that there will be more like co-living towns and villages that appear out there. A great example is also this Bulgarian town of Bansko, where you have small population, but about 10 co-working spaces and people from all around the world are moving there, to live there, to share their lifestyle and also to work there together. This is how the future of work will look like. People will live in better environments. They will avoid more and more the big polluted cities they will be closer to the nature and also they will have the conditions there to work efficiently. They will have uh, nice offices, nice spaces to socialize, to relax, to have meetings and to be productive. I think countries would have to really change some of their laws around remote work and how companies can hire talent and retain it in different places, um, how dispersed they their team could be, it will have to work around remote work for sure. How important it's to encourage people to develop themselves? People that are always self-improving, 
are really the true members of our community since uh, the whole uh, company started. This is actually one of our core values and uh, we believe that if people continue to develop themselves in and outside work, they will inevitably want to grow professionally in every way as well. If you want to be innovative and uh, if you want to really make an impact, then you need to be eager to learn and us giving those opportunities to people is at the core of this uh, value and mission. How the partnership between SoftUni and Motion Software improves the walkaway ecosystem? Over the past four years, we've trained more than 250 graduates from the software university to become professional software developers. We designed a dedicated bootcamp program where people without experience become professionals by going through the full stack of technologies, frameworks, knowledge that they need in order to be in the top 5% of the professionals in the industry. And thus we've produced lots of professionals who are now working for some of the biggest companies in the ecosystem. That makes us really happy because we also made them happy people. It is very difficult for juniors generally to get there into their first job, not having much experience. So I think we have been that really vital in trying to empower them to become better professionals and to really help them work on real life projects, being mentored at the same time by more experienced developers than themselves. What type of people would succeed at Motion Software? For us, it's not that important how experienced is the candidate or what kind of degrees the candidate has. The attitude is the most important. So if you show willingness to improve yourself and if you show also more specific qualities like attention to detail, proactiveness, good communication, for sure you have a place within our team. I believe people eager to learn are the best match for motion and really people that want to make an impact on an industry and also in general on new innovative software projects. <laughs>